Let's talk about the beating that New Jersey is currently on the wrong end of. A few of you took exception with the fact that I said Montreal got worked a couple of days ago by Dallas. You know what? Fair enough. I tried to have fun with my titles, but that was maybe a bit too far. Today, however, Washington is really working New Jersey, just like Columbus worked my poor Rangers last night. I'm recording as the third period starting, but I feel pretty confident about this one, even though New Jersey is drastically out shooting Washington, and Ovi even got his ankles sort of broken once. Washington has all the pressure, and I think that is best shown by this short-handed goal. Washington was doing a pretty aggressive press on the penalty kill, and New Jersey was also pretty flat-footed. You can see how far back their forwards are. So the defenseman, in order to try to make a breakout pass, it's a donut across the middle of the ice, which Connor Sheary easily picks off, then roofs. You can see on the setup here again, New Jersey was too far back. Orlov was on the one streaking forward, so the puck carrier tried to make a risky cross-ice pass, and it obviously didn't work. Ideally, he probably should have slowed down, given the rush time to develop, but again, Again, that's what sustained pressure from Washington does. We see the opposite when Washington got their own power play goal from, you guessed it, Ovechkin, and you'll never guess where he was standing, but that's a good situation. They kept trying to feed the puck to Ovechkin. They failed the first time, but they slowed it down. They worked it over and eventually a goal from the greatest goal scorer in the game right now. So yeah, not super interested to see how this one ends. I'm going to check out a different game for the rest of the day. Are you watching this one though? Are you a Washington fan or a New Jersey fan? What have you thought of your team's play today? Ovechkin's having a pretty quietly decent start to his year. This will be goal number three in seven games and point number six. But of course, the man's shooting like a maniac, so it wouldn't be surprised to see his scoring take a jump up.